In this video, we'll be going over how to find the distance between two points. To do so, we just have to use this equation. Distance is equal to the square root of x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. Or another way of saying this, distance is equal to the square root of the change in x squared plus the change in y squared. Let's apply that to this problem. We're given two points, and we want to find the distance between point A and point B. So to do this, we would just have to use this equation. And it doesn't really matter what you call 1 or 2. We can just call A uh, 2. So we can say this is x2, x, uh, y2. And then this is going to be x1, y1. And then now we can just plug it into the equation. Distance is equal to the square root of x2. Well, x2 is 9 minus x1, which is 3, squared plus y2, which is 7 minus y1, which is 2, squared. And then now we just simplify this. 9 minus 3, that's 6. So that'll be 6 squared plus 7 minus 2 is 5. And that'll be 5 squared. Then that just becomes 36 plus 25. And then that's going to equal the square root of 61. So we can just leave it like this, or we can plug this into the calculator. Square root of 61 gives us 7.81. And like I said before, it doesn't matter if we call, which one we call 1 and which one we call 2. We could call this point 1, and we could call this point 2, and that would have been the same. I'll show you, I'll show you that, why that's the case. So as you can see right here, if we were to switch the, the two points, instead of 9 minus 3, it will be 3 minus 9, and instead of two minus, 7 minus 2, it will be 2 minus 7. Well, we get negative 6 squared plus negative 5 squared, but because we're squaring it, that's just going to take the negative way. So you're still going to get 36 plus 25. So you're still going to get the square root of 61. So regardless if you call this point 0.2 or point 0.1, you're still going to get the same answer. Let's try this uh, with another example. Okay, so here's the next next example. Again, it doesn't matter which point we call 1 or 2. So I guess I'll just call the point on the right 2. So this would be x2, that's y2, and then this would be x1 and y1. Then we can just use this equation. Distance is equal to the square root of x2, which is 7 minus x1, negative 3, squared, plus y2, which is 1, negative 1, minus y1, which is 5, and then square that. So 7 minus negative 3, that's the same as 7 plus 3, because double negatives make a positive. Then that'll be 10 squared plus negative 1 minus 5, that's negative 6 squared. 10 squared is 100, and negative 6 squared, that's 36. So this is going to equal square root of 136. So we can leave it like that, or we can enter this into the calculator, which equals 11.66. And that's how you would find the distance between two points. You would just use this equation x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. So just find the differences between the x squared plus the difference between the y squared. And it doesn't matter which point you call 1 and which point you call 2.